Welcome to Reef Diary, day 27. So today's uh, day started off kind of a continuation of last night. I told him all I want to do is wrap the tank in cardboard so I can't see it anymore. I just don't want to look at it anymore. <sighs> but uh, it's not quite as bad as all that. I just get frustrated at times, as you know. So some people keep asking questions or uh, throwing out ideas and I just need to kind of clarify a couple of points even though it's going to land on deaf ears because the ones that need to see it will never see this video. The sky LED lights have no bearing on what's going on with the corals in my reef and they were looking better and better the longer I ran the lights so that has it's not that and I've actually since all this happened I reduced the intensity of the, t of the lighting of the tank from 60% down to 40% just so I don't cook the tissue of the corals that are struggling so hard to survive all the crazy ordeal that I put them through. Uh, several people have asked me point blank, well, what do you think happened then? And I think it's a combination of things. I believe that my alkalinity was too high with my nitrate and phosphate getting down to the low levels finally, and treating for cyanobacteria caused a loss of good beneficial bacteria at the same time. So nitrate came down too quickly near the end there. It kind of steamrolled on me. I killed my good bacteria and the alkalinity was too high instead of being down low to match the low uh, nutrient level. Yeah, low-ish. 0.25 phosphates and 15 uh, ppm of nitrate is better, but I don't really consider that low. Low as you guys with two nitrate and 0 0.03 phosphate. However, this is where we are. I've been watching the pH and since replacing the probe last night and the tank got down to a low of 8.0 and it got up to a high of 8.1 so my swing today was really 0.1. Alkalinity is right at 8.8. .8. It's kind of hovering right there. It's kind of a sweet spot. Surely I'd like 9 but 8.8 .8 is fine. If I can just stay 8.8 .8 for a few days <laughs> that also works. And tonight's update. See how green that is? That's supposed to be vivid green and it's very pale. It's very misleading to film it. That lost some tissue today. That's losing a little bit of tissue. And here's the anemone cube. I almost want to film the anemone cube exclusively for a few diaries just because the reef tank isn't the way I want it to be. And if you look closely, you'll actually see some clownfish. People always seem to forget there's clownfish in here. There's 12. And they love to hide inside those tentacles, but when it's time to feed the tank, they all come swarming to the top, I guarantee it. Other than that, I didn't do anything with the tank today. I just kind of worked and took care of business. And this is today's update. So I hope you enjoyed it and we'll see what tomorrow brings. Thanks for watching.